Okay, if you have a not stock throttle or if you uh, maybe want to adjust your throttle parameters, we're going to go over how to do that real quick. So I'm going to open up Kilowatt. I'm going to turn on my bike. And uh, just to be sure I'm safe, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to lift the back wheel while I'm doing this. So we automatically went into my setup um, for the bike that I just turned on. So I care about the second tab here, throttle. At the very top, that box uh, that says 0.904 volts, that's going to be reading out exactly what my throttle is putting out. Um, so that's at zero. And if I full throttle, I can see it goes to 4.04. Um, those are my zero and 100% throttle levels. Um, and if I need to change them, I'll go into advanced throttle parameters. And I see my first two boxes are what I care about, 0.904 volts and 4.1 volts. So if I ever want to change this, I can just make it go down a little bit. We'll go to like that. Wait for it to update. And after we've changed our parameters, I can go back to the throttle main page. And I'll just throttle again, make sure everything works. make sure I'm not getting any errors and to lock it in all I do is click save and it'll tell me your settings have been saved so this is if you have a different throttle um, if you put it on the stock system you know those those other throttles can actually fool the stock system but they will cause errors on ours because it's tuned for a very specific throttle and <laughs> our system can't be fooled as easily all right thanks